From the very beginnings of skiing to the present day, skis have been made from wood. Modern skis are high-end technical sports equipment manufactured in sandwich construction from various materials, such as carbon fibers, glass fibers, and high-tech composites. Over time, many alternative materials have been tested and analyzed. However, the wooden core is still state-of-the-art. The types of wood used for the core determine the characteristics of the ski, especially in terms of stiffness, torsional strength, and damping. Although wood is regenerative raw material, the specific types of wood that are required for ski cores are sometimes difficult to obtain, which makes the material expensive. Furthermore, wood is a non-homogeneous material and contains knots that can adversely affect its quality. And when it comes to recycling, it's practically impossible to separate the individual layers of a used ski, so the wooden core cannot be recycled as a separate component. Researchers at TUVIN have now developed a new high-performance textile reinforced concrete core that opens up a whole new spectrum for sports equipment such as skis, snowboards, water skis and wakeboards. Textile reinforcement exhibits high performance and does not corrode, thus enabling the production of filigree concrete elements. The textile reinforcement layer can consist of synthetic fibers, glass fibers, basalt fibers, but also natural fibers, for example bamboo, and is preferably pre-stressed. The pre-stressing of the textile can be easily adjusted during production and in conjunction with basic variations of the reinforcement ratio. Specific characteristics such as hardness, radius, damping of the ski can be configured to create, for example, a soft freeride ski, a stiff alpine ski, a customized racing ski, or a bespoke personalized ski. Although it may sound contradictory at first glance, the concrete cores represent a highly competitive alternative to wooden cores in terms of sustainability. Unlike with wooden cores, it's possible to use locally available raw materials, for example, concretes with a very low clinker content, thus minimizing the carbon footprint. The core can also be recycled as the textile and concrete materials can be separated. <laughs>